Hello, people of the internet, my name is Johnny, and welcome back to another video discussing the next possible character for FNAF AR. Now, this isn't the first time we've done this, right? We've done it for Plus Trap, we've done it for Withered Bonnie, Lefty, and all of those turned out to be false, right? Those characters did not release, and instead we got brand new ones. Well, I am here today to hopefully 100% predict the character coming to FNAF AR this week. And I say this week because Belor's event, you know, the tickets when you get your prize and it says, oh, there's this many days left for the event. It says three days. Monday, Tuesday, Wednesday. Or Tuesday, Wednesday, Thursday. Whatever counting system you want to use. So that's the logic I'm going off on. If the event ends on that Thursday, then the next character should come out on that Thursday. But who knows? Kieran Lily made a post to her Instagram the other day saying that she's currently thinking of new skin ideas, so maybe it's gonna be a skin. But for this video, we're gonna say it is the new character. So who am I talking about? Well, I mean, you've seen it in the thumbnail, you've seen it in the title. I am, of course, talking about our boy, Funtime Freddy. Funtime Freddy is not new to the prediction for the next character list at all. He's been in the files for months at this point. Illumix even teased an image with the endoskeleton standing in front of a bunch of gift boxes, and on one of the gift boxes was a face of Funtime Freddy. As well as Plus Trap and Lefty, but for some reason they are not in the game, even though they have clearly been teased, and they are again in the files just like Funtime Freddy, but whatever. Yeah, so the lures and icons and CPUs of Funtime Freddy are already in the the game's files. We made a video about this again a couple months ago. And so now, I want to go back to the image that Illumix released a couple days ago before Beloa came out, and that is the circus poster. The tweet says, this fall, come one, come all, and then it has a picture of Beloa's shadow in front of a circus poster. We discuss it more in the video, but just in case you missed it, we predicted that the Twisted Magic was going to be for Funtime Freddy, because maybe he would pull Bon Bon, a bunny, out of his top hat. Ravenous Animals, that is of course Funtime Foxy, because Fox is or ravenous animals. Mesmerizing dances, of course that's Blora because she literally is a ballerina and she dances and sings a lot. And fun with clowns could either be Ennard, which is the way I'm leaning towards because so far we've only gotten the fun time characters. At least going off of this poster, that's why I'm leaning more towards Ennard, but also some people say it could be Scrap Baby. Okay, so we've picked apart this image, right? But a discovery was made a couple days ago, and by a couple days ago I mean we have like yesterday or two days ago, it's really not all that old. And I don't know how someone found this, but basically what you have to do is you have to turn the picture 180 degrees so it's upside down. And then off to the far right next to Chica's face, you can see Funtime Freddy's face. Now, a lot of people are mixed about this. Personally, I do see it. A lot of people, you know, chalk this up to Pareidolia, which I don't think that's the case. Which, by the way, if you don't know what Pareidolia is, it's basically seeing something like a shape or a face in something that isn't supposed to be there. Like seeing shapes in the clouds or seeing faces on objects. <laughs> a lot of people saying it's just the design of the bricks, but personally, I don't think that's the case. You can clearly see the outline of Funtime Freddy's face at the very least, you can see his pupil. Also, his texture has apparently been found in the files. Honestly, I cannot confirm 100% if this is real. I have seen a few people dismissing this as false. Now, I tried to look for this on the Reddit, but I could only find this in Puggo's Pizzeria's video, so... Puggo, if you're lying to us, man, I'm coming after you. I'm just kidding. So let's take all of this as true, and Funtime Freddy is the next character coming this week. What is his mechanic? Well, I have a few ideas. I think we were all shocked when we learned that Beloa wasn't the only new character in the update last week. We also got the Minuinas in the game. So I don't think it would be all that surprising if not only Funtime Freddy attacks us, but also Bon Bon. And I know that it's everybody's prediction and hope for his mechanic. Honestly, if they don't make Funtime Freddy yell, Bon Bon, go get him, and then he throws Bon Bon at us, Illumix, you funked up. I think I talked about this in one of my earlier videos, but having Funtime Freddy say either Bon Bon go get him or get ready for a surprise, I feel like that's probably what they're gonna do. Unfortunately, that does mean reusing Funtime Freddy's voice lines, which I'm not a huge fan of. I would love to have new voice lines, not only for Funtime Freddy, but also below Come on, Illumix, what are you doing? Apparently, it was revealed that Illumix didn't even reach out to Michelle Moss, the voice actress for Belor. So what the heck? A lot of people are saying that Funtime Freddy is getting new voice lines because Darko reached out to Kellen about singing the Count the Way song, but he said he was busy. And to that I say, 
Fun Time Freddy is not Kellen's only voice job. The man has probably hundreds of characters he voices, so give him a break. FNAF isn't the only thing he does. Yeah, I'm hoping for new voice lines, um, but at the same time, I feel like because we didn't get some for Blower, I don't think we'll get some for Funtime Freddy, which is really upsetting. Again, I would love new voice lines for Freddy, but I have a feeling we might not, but at the same time, his voice is so iconic. Anyways, going back to mechanics. My idea was, if he says, Bon Bon, go get him, you just stay in that area, or if he says get ready for surprise, you have to turn 180 or just find a new static area. I don't know, it's an idea. And while we're on the topics of mechanics, I had another one for Funtime Foxy that I thought of the other day. Honestly, the flashlight mechanic is kind of useless. Uh, it's easy, at least for me, to find the static without it. I know a lot of people use the flashlight, but really you don't have to. So I think making it a mandatory thing to use in Funtime Foxy's fight would be a good idea. Not only does it give a good use for the flashlight, but it also is a callback to Funtime Foxy's auditorium from Sister location where you have to flash the flash beacon but you can't flash it too often or you'll get jump scared but you can't flash it too less or you'll also get jump scared. I feel like if you flash it every now and then you have to try and find Foxy and then kind of like the distractions you know when you catch a character in a pose and they fade away I think having something like that and if you do it enough times they get you or like they run at you, I think that'd be a good idea for Funtime Foxy. Again, it's just a thought, but it also is a great callback, so I have a feeling they're gonna probably do something along that line. Again, this is kind of a speculation slash prediction video because A, a lot of people are dismissing the fact that you can see Freddy in the poster, but I very clearly can see him, so it's not Paridolia. Also B, a lot of people are unsure if the texture is a false texture that someone just made up on their own. Again, I've only seen it in one YouTube video so far, I haven't seen it on the Reddit anywhere, so the lack of it being spread around makes me think, okay, maybe it could be false. But the poster though, come on, you can clearly see it's Funtime Freddy off to the far right when you flip it 180 degrees. Why someone did that in the first place, I have no freaking clue. But that is it for this video. Hopefully, Funtime Freddy is coming because I know a lot of people would love to see him in the game. So that's gonna do it for this prediction slash analysis slash whatever you wanna classify this video as for FNAF AR. I definitely do think that we are getting the Funtime characters by the end of this year. It's very clearly been teased in the circus poster. Stay tuned for more information. Maybe we're gonna get a teaser for Freddy like we did with the blower, I don't know. But that's gonna be it for this video. Hopefully, my mystery minis arrived today, because on the website, it says that they do, but it also hasn't given me an update on their location just yet, so who knows what's going on with that. Hopefully, they arrive soon, though. So, again, thanks for watching, and I'll see you all on the flip side. Goodbye.